Hacking Cloud server. And here I use your player, my fan. So our server restarted yesterday and we did a bunch of like streaming. I think I streamed like for five hours on over at Twitch. Yeah, Twitch. And we did a lot of stuff. Like we already be in Nether. I think we'll unlock it like within 30 minutes. As I found some lava and had a bucket, so I next sounded like Oh. I think it was me stepping on this lamp. But yeah. We have some spam stuff happening. And there was lots of dying, like swimming out of the sea and stuff. Uh, yeah, I already have some iron gear and a few diamond pickaxes. We have en enchanting setup going in there. Floating trees, some, well, inventory spaces, trees, farming, etc. Bamboo. And what next? I am going to do is make a skelly spawner. Oh, sorry, skelly grinder. There's actually two skelly spawners in this our mushroom island. And I've already made path to one. So the one we have is right here. Like here in the corner, where's a few bases already, or spawn huts. So we just drop down, hopefully don't die, and find it. There wasn't any chest here. But yeah. So the plan is just make the area. I have to check what the dimensions are. I think it was 9 by 9. And 2 up, 4 down, or something like that. So yeah. I have some safe space around here and maybe do something killing over there. I don't know. We'll see. Uh, I will be double checking the dimensions before I start digging this down. Yeah, I should be enough stuff here. I can let just put down the chest. Oh, and I actually forgot to do stuff here. So pressure plate and here. Okay, that's working. So now I can go working on this digging this stuff. Be right back. I mined the area, so it was nine by nine. Is the area then it was three up and four down yeah I had to check it because I haven't played Minecraft in a long while and uh, apparently I forgot to add that one just so the mobs won't spawn on top of the spawner so I made just normal like water shoot canal here and I added some ice to make mobs move faster, but apparently the water physics are a little bit odd. And here is just drop shoot falling down. This should be 21 blocks. So it should be okay. And then they drop here. Let's make a little bit better area. Just widening up. I guess someone became a drowned. Yeah, so if I want to make some sorting system, I can make it that way. So, most likely, I'm going to put. Uh, yeah, let's add this basalt there. So I'm adding a drop, uh, sorry, the hopper here. 
and then most likely a chest here at start. Yeah, I'm keeping this up j just for a moment at least until I start breaking. I'm debating on if I want to make this look prettier and looks like I missed a spot. So yeah, I don't know if I want to make it prettier or just have it like it is. Well, actually, there's no reason to have it pretty because nobody will see it. And if it starts bothering me enough, then I can just make it. Though it's hard because there's lava right next to this wall. I tried to clean it most up a little bit, but I don't know how well it went. So basically what is left is just break all the torches and run. And let's see, how do I want to do it? Yeah, I have the hopper. Okay, I had to break this up for a moment. Have this open and to be ready to put the dropper. Oh well, let's see how it goes. This should be okay. We'll start at the corner. And oh, they are here. <laughs> Let's go. Oh boy. This is a bit too high. Because they... Oh yeah, maybe not. Because I did hurt some of them. We'll see how this goes. Because I wanted them to be one hit kill. And if they keep dying then I have to raise this up. Okay. Looks promising. Okay, so it they aren't one hit kill, but almost. So I think this is okay for me. Then I can just kill and collect XP. So I think that's something that I am going to do. Just kill some skellies, get the drops and see how things goes. Uh, actually, let me. No. Uh, oh. Wrong. Uh, I was supposed to go here. I want to take that lava. So I have like a trash bin that I can use. And. No, oh, yeah, didn't use that. Let's just make normal wall. Okay, I shouldn't be able to drop there, but I can do that. Okay, that's good. And yeah, let's see what I'll be doing with these guys in a while.
this scale is partner outside a little bit grittier, so if you're mining around you don't accidentally go in. Though I'm not sure about these basalt blocks, if they are... Yeah, I think they're pretty much insta-mineable, but mostly it's made of wood, the casings. There are a few pillars over there that are made of this, but there should be a little bit cobblestone up higher to notice. This drop shoot isn't like protected with this, so basically you can accidentally mine there. But if you take notice that this is I-12, so most likely up here people aren't going to insta mine. Hopefully. Of course some other time I might open this space more up to be more usable. But yeah. Things are looking good, and there's actually one way to think that I could upgrade this place. Proof is using docks. So I don't really know how they probably should work. Because, okay, this hurts him. Okay. So I don't know how I should use it properly because okay there so I don't know how this works as Akkas sometimes he attacks but sometimes he doesn't I do have backup dogs here just in case this dies but yeah I had to look more up on how to use these dogs on killing these skeletons. Yeah, because sometimes like he loses his interest. Oh, and there's that. Uh, let's block that for a while. Yeah, I think I might even use some Hopper Minecraft cart here to get better drops from so they don't spit out. And of course I need to make the sorting system. But most likely I will be doing that some other time, because I need to gather some materials for this. And again, he's not working. I might... Uh, let's see if I... If it works, if he's some higher. Yeah, I... I think there might be some drowns somewhere. Come on, dog. Don't go to lava. Yeah. Let's go to the mine. Go to the minecart. Please. Yeah, I haven't played with this dog, so I don't really know what I'm doing, honestly. Nope, he's not wanting to cooperate. Let's try pushing him off. Hey, come on. It's not working. <laughs> okay. Yeah, yeah. I think I really have to look out the proper way. And it went here. Okay, now. Will you now do the working for me? It could be this side. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know how it's going to work, but I'm going to figure that out. But I think I'll be keeping this episode short. Oh yeah, I have diamonds gear now. 
So I'll be ending the video now and I'm planning to do some streaming of this server more like like before and keep doing these videos and we'll see how things will go. Let's eat that potatoes to clean this inventory. So things will be now and stay tuned for the next stuff some other time. Bye bye. Okay, a few things first before actually ending the episode. I totally forgot that when I start recording, there's quite a long delay before my voice comes up, as you might noticed from the start. So yeah, I really have to remember that one. And also I need to improve my pronunciation of English as I'm not a native speaker. So it will sound a little bit better. So I actually did hear some other stuff. Uh, actually, you can see I went mining. I have some silk, like uh, diamond picks, good ones, and also some ancient debris. So I just need one more, then I can make a netherite pick, which I want to do quite soon, right after this video. But now I just need to get some levels so I can enchant some iron picks that I can use them. And some other thing you might notice I actually lowered this by one block as I noticed that they can still survive it. So now they are actually one hit kill. And let's see if we get one skeleton. Come on. And there, one hit kill. Uh, also, I looked up and I think you need one and a half block room for these dogs to reliably. What's the word? I don't know. So, yeah, to make this one and a half block room to make sure the dogs kill these skeletons. I could use two dogs there, but I think this one is doing good enough job. So just in case he dies because skeletons has armor that has a thorns, I can breed more. I have a little bit rotten flesh here. So at the moment it's fully scalable farming. Of course, I need to make better storage room. But actually now I shouldn't be able to get any bows. So I need to make some other improvements here. Uh, but yeah, that is some other stuff. But for now, really, time to end. <laughs>